Hello and welcome back to Let's Try. We're trying Backpack Hero. Uh, I'm very grateful to be able to try this game and I am able to do so courtesy of the Game Development World Championship as well as Jess Bell uh, Games. I really appreciate y'all for, for hooking me up with this. Um, the Game De Development World Championship is a site you can go to check out new games or if you're a developer you can compete for some prizes. And that about does that. And uh, let's check out Backpack here. I've been uh, pretty excited to try this out. I saw it on Kickstarter and I've seen uh, a lot of other tubers. You know, you know tubers? They're kind of like potatoes. Um, playing this game and it's look, looking really cute and really uh, fun. You must conquer the dungeon uh, by delving deep to the center to discover the ancient cheeses. Of course, of course, the, ch the ancient cheeses, of course. Hidden there, you are armed only with your magic backpack. You head into the dungeon knowing very few will make it back alive. All right, um, click me. I'm clicking you. I have done it, I've clicked you. And now I've clicked that. Add all items to your backpack to continue. So from what I understand, this is kind of like a Resident Evil uh, inventory simulator. I can't fit all of these things. Are you mad? I cannot fit all of these things though. This is impossible. This is, You've given me an impossible task. Oh wait, I can rotate them. Uh, while holding an item, you can press right click to... Okay, we, we, all right, we can fit all of these things. You did not give me an impossible task actually. All right, I've clicked the map and I'm clicking you and I appreciate the very straightforward guidance. In combat, you click items to use them. You must defeat all enemies to continue. So on use, adds seven block, uh, adds two energy. When out of uses, this item is destroyed. Um, and then on use, deal seven damage. So from what I can tell, um, oh, in combat, you click on items. Okay. Uh, from what I can tell, uh, and I really hope that this is not unfair. This kind of feels like a novel spin on the deck built deck building format. And instead of cards, we're basically given items and we have to kind of uh, arrange them in our inventory. I think that's actually really novel and uh, it's, I'm, I'm sure a lot of people will appreciate the idea of a deck builder without cards because I know uh, a few people are pretty burnt out on cards. Um, so, all right, we've done our moves, but do we want to use our meal? I don't, I don't think so. I would imagine there's going to be a boss in which case we'll want to use some of our consumables. So um, we want to use our shield because they're going to do seven damage. And then we're going to smack them a couple times and end our turn. Uh, oh, there is no reason to do that actually. I shouldn't have done that. It's fine, I win. I level up. Okay, cho choose four spaces. Interesting. Oh, I like that. All right, let's do three on the top and then one on the side on the top. Done. Get items. Okay, we've got some new items. Can be used one time each turn. Deals three combat to all enemies. Interesting. This is armor to the left gets plus two block. We don't have any armor. This is armor. Adjacent and diagonal armor again. Okay, this is already getting very complicated. <laughs> this is already very complicated. Oh my god. Okay, when combat ends, add luck. All right, well, we can we could add that. That seems like an easy add. Um, let's, like, move this around, and then we'll move this here. And then, is this three? Yeah, we can, we could do that. I don't know if I want to do that, though. How much is this? It looks like it's two by two, so I, I don't think I can grab that if I want the luck ring. And then this is going to be, oh, it's, it is, this is two by two as well. Or, sorry, two by one. Add eight block. So we could have more block. Armor to the left gets plus two block. On use, add five block. Uh, you know, I feel like I was on to something when I played with the idea of adding this other weapon. What is this? I haven't even looked at this. For each empty space to the right, this item gets plus one damage and then it deals two damage. Interesting. Uh, we could make that happen. This deals three damage to all enemies or we could deal five damage. Let's do that. 
I'm kind of I'm kind of interested in that. And then this potion here deals 12 damage to all enemies, and then it's destroyed. Why don't we grab that, and then we'll do 12 damage to like the first enemy we come across. Finish choosing. I appreciate even in the very early stages of this game, the choices are hard because they're good choices. You know, like I don't have to choose between a bunch of items that all feel like downgrades. I feel like I've been doing that a lot lately. All right, so what are we doing? All right, we've got a lot more stuff going on here. Um, what, who is this person? Are we attacking them? Visions of danger. So I guess we're gonna be fighting that, maybe? Well, we don't seem to be fighting that. So let's, uh, like, right away, let's just use our acidic potion. So we did we did some damage. Um, why can't we use this? This item is a projectile. I know that. Cannot be used. What do you mean, cannot be used? Um, what? I'm a little confused on that one. Do I, do I need, um, weapon arrow? I'm wondering if I need a weapon to fire it. Well, we'll, we'll figure that out later, maybe. They're about to do 10 damage to me, so we're going to want to block a, a little bit of that. And now they're doing 9 damage, so it seems like this uh, enemy scales down, adds one week to enemy. When an item is used, adds one week. Uh, each combat adds six block to enemy. You will get five experience for defeating this enemy, and I need nine more to level up. Okay. So this seems like a complete loss. It doesn't seem to do anything. All right. So uh, they seem to do less damage every time I hit them. In fact, every time I do anything, they seem to do less damage. All right, I'm learning things, I'm learning. I don't know why this is the case. When an item is used, adds one weak to enemy. I guess, I guess they have a lot of weak. Weak will reduce six damage when attacking. I see, so the more weak they have, the less damage they do, and then the less damage we take. I gotcha. Cool. We're gonna get some more items, including a brick. What is this brick gonna do? For each adjacent structure, this item gets plus one block and it adds zero block. So we want a lot of structures in order to make use of that. Uh, we can get another acidic potion. Uh, dragonfly accessory, each turn moves forward one space, turn clockwise. When this moves, uh, what? <laughs> what? Adjacent weapons get plus five damage this turn. Move. Each turn moves forward one space, turns clockwise. When this moves, adjacent what? Hmm, okay. Well, um, I guess it's gonna affect this thing, but I, I kinda wanna just get rid of this thing. I like kinda, I, this is a weird little touch, but I appreciate the little motion blur um, when moving things around. Can be used one time each turn, adds two poison. Well, let's do this, cause then this is affecting both of those lads. We could get some food. Oh, this ad, this loses our food. No. What does this do? Deal eight damage, three uses, and then it's destroyed. Meh. I, I'm good. Mana stone? Gold? Do we, we get to keep those, right? Okay, we have finished choosing. I gotta say, I'm already pretty invested in this. Surprise, surprise. This one has been really kind of making the rounds, and uh, I think for good reason. So this one, it isn't, it hasn't moved yet. I guess it can't move, right? Is that what I'm getting? Maybe I should have, uh, maybe I should use up this food and then I'll have a bit more space to, to move things around. So let's select this lad. I don't know what they're doing. We'll add one of these curses, curse of honey. Uh, on take damage adds one rage to enemy. If we can kill them this round, that would be good. We can do eight damage and seven damage, so not quite, but we will poison them, so I'm hoping poison, I'm hoping, I'm hoping, I'm hoping, I'm hoping that, well, we can just kill them, so we don't have to worry too much, and this, this guy is uh, going to armor themselves up, which is fine. We can block their attack and then start wearing them down. And they're poisoned. We're increasing their poison. Quite a bit. Not quite enough to kill them. 
that does do raw damage. I always appreciate it when poison does raw damage. What are you about to do? Poison sickness will not take any action. Oh, really? So does poison do more than just uh, hurt? Does it does it also prevent them from attacking occasionally? Okay, let's uh, put one on the side there. I really like that the backpack gets bigger as you're like growing it. So we're 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 making we're making it grow. All right, get some items. So what have we got here? Ooh, this is a legendary mirror shield. Add six block. Removes two spikes from enemy. Removes two rage from enemy. That sounds like a good item. Um, on use deals eight damage. Plus one to the energy cost for this turn. Uh, oh, I see. So every time we use it, it's going to cost more energy. Mm, I do really like the dagger. Wouldn't mind get, uh, taking another dagger. And what's this blue fish? On use heals. This item is destroyed. Can we, like, grab it and then use it? Can't take any more items. Well, it won't let me use it. I guess that you can only use it in combat. My first wand, conductive, adds two regen to self. And then can be used one time each turn. If you have any armor, this item gets negative four damage. On use, deals extra damage. Okay. Um, I kind of want to get rid of this food. So we'll take this, uh, we'll take this dagger. What do you mean can't take any more items? I can only take three items? Oh, that's interesting. I thought we were only limited to the size of our backpack. All right, well, I guess if that's the case, then um, I'm, I'm okay with what I've got. Do I, did I manage to keep that food? No, I didn't, okay. Uh, we have more things we have to play with here. Add zero, eight haste to self, add two weak to self. Um, we could, I think the potion will be good. That seems like a good little lifesaver. Uh, and then we're gonna go to a forge. I wonder if we can upgrade our things. I am a crafter. 12 gold, and we can add one poison to a weapon. How much gold do we have? Not enough gold. We need an indicator somewhere that tells me how much gold we have. Add conductive to armor. Not enough gold. Okay, so we have no gold. <laughs> Absolutely no gold. Gotcha. Enemies here, little bee, hermit, crab, bomb. All right. So, um, on use, we'll add block, removes spikes, removes rage. We pretty much want to um, kill the, ooh, I didn't mean to do that, actually. I wanted to, to attack the bee. Um, hmm, can this do, no, this can't do anything. Well, it does zero, uh, zero energy, so I can use it and then kill the bee before they have a chance to do anything. Uh, they're apparent this guy is apparently not going to take any damage this turn. Oh, this is the kind of enemy that's going to but well, we have to deal with very quickly because they're going to like explode soon enough Reorganize now to claim this item. What is this? This item is a projectile deal 10 damage to all enemies Weird, so this is just like kind of drop somewhere. I Don't think I want to use that right now. I think I'm okay with what I've got actually. I've got exactly enough energy I can play like all of my weapons each turn. We could take that dart dagger. Zero energy can be used one time each turn, deals two damage. Almost want to go full um, like glass cannon. We could get rid of this bu rough buckler. And then we could take maybe some little daggers to, to needle down our enemy. Use to reroll your combat rewards. Weapon, weapons two spaces away get plus four damage. Interesting. So if we wanted to be really crafty here, um, we would put this here and then we could put this guy here and then this is gonna go like here and then now we're, we're buffing two weapons at once. Actually, if we wanted, to, we could go even harder here and we could go do this and then we could put a dagger like here and now we're buffing three weapons at once solid so what is this deal seven damages gets plus one damage this turn uh, we could get another wooden blade I'll take this oh we can't take anymore okay so we're going pretty glass cannon a surprise surprise I tend to like glass cannon builds so what is this a merchant is selling goods here I, I doubt I will be able to make use of them but I'll try I have a selection 
from across the land. Still don't really have an indicator of how much money I have. If there is an adjacent weapon, this item gets negative three damage, deals four damage to all enemies. Um, do we want a small key? Can't afford. Uh, we can't probably afford anything, can we? No, okay. So let's go to this place. Maybe it will heal us. We don't have a key, so we can't go inside. All right, so we're gonna go fight some more enemies. Um, so this seemed to rotate. I'm not sure, I really don't know how this dragonfly works, so probably I'm not using it very well. So this guy's gonna do seven damage. We, sh we might be able to take them out like now. We just did eight damage. Oh yeah, we, we can take them out now. And in fact, we can continue doing some damage. I, I like our build right now. It's it's pretty good. So they're gonna do some nasty damage, but I'm pretty sure we can take them out now. Oh no, they've got some. They've got a lot of armor, and they've also they're about to do some pretty good damage to us. So we want to reduce some of it. I don't think I did all of my available attacks. Not sure. Okay. We leveled up. Um, so I wanna kind of double down on this pearl. So I think the best way to do that would be if I put a couple spaces down here, cause then I have a, a center block that I can kind of make use of. Let's, let's get rid of that. And then we're gonna go like here, cause I wanna have a middle block that has reach two spaces away from all sides. Let's see what we got here, whoa. Conductive deals four damage to all enemies. This item is used. It's used each turn. So apparently it just uses itself. We've got a key. I definitely want that. Lady, Dark Lady's Potion. Deals 18 damage. This item is destroyed. Oh, I kind of want that armor. All right, let's see if we can't figure. Okay, so the pearl, the pearl is pretty much good to go now. Um, it's, it's now buffing several things at once which is great this thing yeah i imagined it was oh i see it's it's not like a normal shape it's actually like a lightning bolt shape interesting um we don't have enough space to take the armor bandages when combat ends heals sounds good and i think that's all we can choose i wouldn't mind taking the shiv oh we can take the shiv can't take any more items. that's fine uh i'm pr pretty happy with all of this actually I do really appreciate like how this whole mechanic works. You really have an incentive to kind of like get your hands dirty with uh, um, organizing your items. So what is this person gonna do? We'll add five burn. We don't really wanna do that. We'll add one of these curses, curse of honey. Hmm, well, let's get rid of the bee. This is gonna do more than five damage. No, it, it didn't do five damage. Okay, we're gonna put the poison on this guy. Oh, they're almost dead. I guess they had they got had enough poison that they couldn't do anything. Adds luck. So we're getting luck every round. So we have a small key. We could get another small key. We could get a sapphire. Adjacent weapons get plus one damage. Kind of tempting. Yeah, we could we could manage that. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Why can't I? Huh? What? Why? I don't understand. Uh, add six mana to connected six mana network. There's like a magic thing. This Oh, I see. This item floats. So it has to be at the top. So we can... Okay. That, that actually makes sense to me now. I gotcha. Um... I think we're done. I don't see myself leveling up anytime soon. All right, let's. Um, can we get a heal? Let me heal you. Oh, you're gonna you're gonna charge me? I don't have any gold. All right, well, whatever. We'll take care of ourselves. As we do, you know. The crypt. Okay, so that was the first level. We're good. Let's see what we got going on here. 
Um, oh, what is that? Is that a merchant? Okay, so we don't necessarily have to go to the merchant right away. Oh, we have a keys. We should check out the uh, the other zone because we could actually open up the door. So this guy's going to do five and six damage respectively. Um, let's use our liquid armor to take care of that and then we can throw down all of our damage on this fellow. And kill them and now they are dead too. And I guess I completely wasted that armor, didn't I? Shoot. So, deal six damage, all diagonal cleavers are used. Interesting. We could get some more luck. I'm not sure what luck is really doing for us, but I don't mind keeping it. This does two vampirism. I have to assume that does a bit of damage and then heals us on use. Uh, and then we have spoiled milk. Adds block, adds three poison to self. When out of uses, this item is destroyed. I think I'm good on that. Um, I'll take the extra luck. I think that that would be a good item. I don't necessarily need anything else. Um, all right, so let's check out this area and use a, one of our keys. You open the door. Cool. We get a treasure chest. Um, with more stuff that we can't necessarily use. We could get something that heals us. Dart. Deal 10 damage to all enemies. Sure, we'll take that. Why not? And then we're gonna go fight another enemy. Oof. See, this is where the potion would have been good. Um, let's use this. Deal damage to everyone. We might have wasted that, but, you know, uh, it ain't no one got time to sit here and, and do math, you know? So we're doing quite a lot of damage from each of those. Let's hit this guy. Actually, let's, let's block. And we're gonna do some poison. Uh, I was hoping that was gonna stop them from doing their attack, but I guess they need to have two bouts of poison before they, uh... So we can heal, oh, that's, that's gonna heal us out of combat. So um, we want to take care of these guys as soon as possible. Um, we should be able to take them both out at the very, yeah, we, we, we were able to do it and we were able to, to up, um, get our some health back as well. Rogue's mask can be used one time each combat. Helmets to the right are disabled. If this is not in the top row, this item is disabled. Okay, very picky. Adds one dodge to self. Um, adds one spikes to self. Is this on use? Each turn, we get some thorns. Um, fishing hook. Creates a fish in an adjacent space. Deals eight damage. Um, interesting. I don't know if I really care for any of this. At least not right now. I guess I like the hatchet. I kind of, I don't know. I think I want to get rid of the dragonfly because I don't think it's actually working right now. I think it needs to be able to move in order to actually buff stuff, and I, I don't want to make room for it. So I'm gonna I'm gonna get rid of it. I am not alone. Buy a wand? No, I'm good. I'm good. I, I don't have any space and I like what I've got right now, so I'm I'm good actually. And I wouldn't mind keeping my gold. Maybe for something like this. Um except I don't have enough to buy anything from this as well. I, I do kind of wish there was an indicator of where, how, like, how much money do we have? I, I, I help. I mean, I believe you. Not enough gold. We don't have any armor. Unless our shield counts as armor. Nope. Man, you just, like, don't get any money in this game, do you? It seems weird to me to be put throwing in mechanics that uh, make use of a currency that you then don't don't hand any out of. Um, I want to use both my poison on her. So, oh, she she's dead. Okay. <laughs> I uh, I thought that I, I just wanted to prevent them from using their move. I didn't really want to like kill them dead like that. We're gonna kill this guy as well, which is gonna take us out of out of danger. This guy's got 17 armor. C cool, cool it there, bud. We are just gonna like waste your armor completely and then poison you for four. Surprised that didn't uh, like s prevent them from using their attack. We're just gonna kill them. Okay, we've leveled up. Uh, I really don't know. I guess I kind of want a vertical thing going on here so that I can get uh, maybe another weapon. Of course, this is like, yeah, it's a two diagonal. 
So that's not going to work. We could take some uh, another hatchet. If you have any armor, this item is disabled when an adjacent weapon is used. Heals one. Oh, okay. Yeah, we could do that. So this is going to heal one every time we use either of these weapons. We could go even harder on this. Yeah, that works. And then... Well, we can't really move anything. Oh, that weapon there was being buffed by the... Yeah, okay. So we can't go too hard on this. Um, I <laughs> The... the things are, are kind of precarious now if I move it over here though I am buffing like several weapons at once so this is still buffing a lot of things and now this is going to heal me every single time I use one of these good lord yo we're also healing I think we could possibly get rid of um this is a legendary item by the way I think we can get rid of the bandage, and then we're going to take some more luck. So we're getting even more luck. I don't know what luck is doing for us. I really don't. But, um, so here's our gold. I don't know why we only have the two gold. Let's check out this. The cards hold your future or your doom. You have six guesses remaining. Oh, we're playing memory, huh? I am really good at this game. Uh, I am really good at this game. So what is this? Uh, curse of poison weapons adjacent and a diagonal weapons get plus one poison to self Is that not bad? This is a curse. Oh It's a it's a curse. I'm it is bad skip curse take three damage. Yeah, I'm fine with taking damage. Wow We got fish. I'm pretty sure I saw that item. Was it this one? No, it wasn't see I'm really good at this game This is this is more of a curse there's the other item. All right. Well, I uh, I'm really good at that game. Let's let's get to our third floor finale. Um, if this is a you know this is pretty short. Uh, it seems to me that it's it's a pretty short game unless the game continues to go. So let's see how difficult this is. They're about to do 14 damage to me, so we're gonna go ahead and block a little bit. And it seems like they do more damage. Aha, they have rage. That's okay, we can remove that rage. So we're gonna go ahead and hit them pretty hard, but not too hard, because I want to be able to use our shield. So yeah, we are healing just about every single move. So the shield didn't really work, because um, using it allowed them to generate one rage so I don't think there's much use in using it I guess we do get to get that we get that armor what is this we'll summon an enemy oh it's one of those huh let's just do a ton of damage to them yeah, we are we are healing at an absurd rate and we're also doing a lot of damage so I really appreciate what's going on, and I honestly don't even think it matters if we take any damage at this point. They ran away. We we absolutely stomped that <laughs> boss into the dirt. Um, all consumables get plus three rage. These are relics. All weapons get plus 150% bonus damage. All weapons get this effect applied. Unused, this gets negative one damage this combat. Hmm... That's kind of tempting because we have a lot of weapons. And so they would all get plus 150%. Like, that's really tempting. It kind of doesn't matter that, uh, that they, they get negative one for that combat. All armor, this affects... No, we're, we're good. Our, our glass seems like our ticket. We're going to take... We're going to lose one luck and one key. And this is going to be an absolutely absurdly powerful run I say absurdly powerful run I did we not just defeat the boss weapons along the dia a diagonal line get plus three damage tempting um, adjacent weapons get plus one damage I mean we could get rid of this and then take this instead and possibly make this work there's maybe a way to, to make this work a smarter person than me would certainly figure this one out okay that's pretty good I'm 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 not unhappy with that adds max 3 HP I'm good honestly right now I just want um, kind of a, a monster to stomp 
Oh, I didn't have a key. I, I got rid of my key so I couldn't go to this other one. So what's what's over here? To the enchanted swamp. Uh, oops. Okay, well, we don't get to go to the swamp. Sucks. Deep cave. Okay, so we're c the, the run continues. Kind of want to see this through to the end, honestly. Like, it's going to get kind of... It's going to get insane. Let's see how much damage we do. Yeah, we're, we're doing some really good damage. We didn't even get through all of our weapons. Oh, we could take another dagger. I don't even know what I would replace at this point. I guess maybe luck. Um, we could maybe start replacing some of our other weapons. Unused deals 16 damage. This use this requires two energy is the problem. So I don't know if that's necessarily worth replacing our. I was thinking of replacing our sword with it. Um. But this might be good. I don't know. What does this do? This only takes one energy. Deals nine damage. Adds three weak to enemy. Plus one to the energy cost for this turn. Yeah. Let's do that. Because this one is seven damage. And this one is nine. And it looks like it's shorter as well. Huh. So we've saved a little bit of space. For each adjacent structure... Okay, well, this isn't, this isn't really going to do anything for us. We'll take this acidic potion just to fill out the space. Oh, wait. No, my my lucky ring. Yeah, I guess I'll take the lucky ring. I don't know what it does, but I, I feel bad getting rid of it at this point. Uh, double poison potion. I'm good. I'm good on all of this. Let's just, like, go and absolutely stomp. So what is this guy doing? Deals 14 vampirism. We'll add 3 poison. I don't think so, buddy. I'm gonna stomp you. <laughs> oh my god. We're doing absurd damage. Okay, we have another dagger. I kind of want to start getting rid of the, the luck rings. This adds more damage. I just want to have a bag full of daggers. <laughs> Alright, um, we could like fight the rest of the stuff. And we should for the sake of the experience. It's a character, you know, it, 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 it's, it's going to build character. Oh my god. Yeah, we can't, we can't even get through all of our weapons. So what is this? Add six rage to self. Hurts. Deals one damage to self. We could take this, but I don't think, we, we don't actually have enough room for it. Ancient tome, ring, when added, adds five max HP. When removed, removes five max. Oh, I see. Um, I think I'm okay. Listen, you, you can say that I'm I'm like doubling doubling down on a fairly basic build, but you know, as I as I always say, bigger number bigger number better, and this is a lot of fun. So, you know, don't don't hate me because I'm beautiful. That's the first time we've actually used all of our weapons. Uh, deal seven damage. The above cleaver is used. This uses two energy I don't know if I want to do that but the thing I like about the cleavers oh I guess they aren't cleavers they're hatchets different okay cactus add seven spikes to self yeah I'm still good if I see something worth taking I'll I'll certainly take it a chest of valuables we'll definitely check out the chest of valuables we have some armor we've got another sword oh wait zero three uses oh no I'm good All right, let's let's continue down the deep cave. I wonder I wonder if this game has first of all if it has meta progression and I also wonder um, if it's going to like if we're going to win on our first run. Are we missing now? Yeah, these guys have dodge. I just noticed. That's okay. Maybe Ho hopefully that's okay. So we're, we're not going to be able to... Uh, let's use our shield. We're not going to actually be able to kill this guy on turn one. Now, now uh, te technically we're doing slightly less damage because 
Uh, every time we use those, they're doing less damage, but it's fine. Should be fine. Kind of just want to like start filling out the backpack in some kind of aesthetic way instead of just like randomly assigning stuff. On damage, add to haste to self. Adjacent armor gets plus one block. Helmets to the right are disabled. If this is not in the top row, this item gets negative two block. Each turn, add two block. Okay, we can make this work. Um, this one says, wait, if this is not in the top row. Okay, we can do that. We'll add that there and then we'll throw that there and then hopefully, is this actually helping? Adjacent armor gets plus one block. Uh, I don't think it's actually helping because I don't think the shield counts as armor, which is a, just a darn shame. We'll take this damaged uh, knife because that is a weapon and it will help us. Hopefully. It's also a zero energy use uh, weapon. So we're gonna just, we don't actually have to use it. In fact, I, I'll, I'll resist using it in the future because like, unless I really need to, oh, third dagger. Kind of really tempting. Deals 33 damage, what? Oh, cause it's got um, a lot of multipliers. I really like these daggers. Does the same, well, it does slightly less damage. Add three weak to enemy. You know what? Wait, is weak less damage? Do they do less damage with weak or I'm wondering if it, we do more damage? I definitely wanna grab this dagger. We're gonna get rid of this ring. Uh, I'm really tempted on this. I think overall it would it will be worth it. This thing's not worth it. Uh, arrow, we're good. Look at how many weapons we have. We're just like an absolute truck of weapons. We have even more weapons to choose from. Um, you know what? Let's get rid of the helmet and take another dagger. Like, like I even give a heck, you know? Ask me if I give a heck and I'll tell you no. We're just gonna be doing absurd damage. Don't worry about us, let's do our three poison daggers. There we go, don't even worry about it. Ooh, dueling sword can be used one time each combat. We, we're okay with that. 25 damage, this item is refreshed and can be used again this combat. On take down, oh I see, so it, we can only use it the one time. You know what? Worthy of uh, getting rid of not just not just the dagger, but I think also our uh, shiv. I guess these are shivs. They deal two damage, but this does 25 damage. I think that's worthwhile. And we only need to use it the one time because we're going to kill everything in our path. Let's use it right away. Smack. Oh, whoops. That was absolutely the worst move we could have made. Uh, I feel like a dang fool there. Oops. Let's, uh, let's try and kill this guy. We did. We could use our, our, our sword. We have one more use on this before it's used up. Um, and since we, it is almost used up, why don't we go ahead and, well, we can't actually use a dagger because, um, it's, we, we want zero cost weapons. It can only be a zero cost weapon that replaces it. So we'll do this and we'll take the cave fish, which is gonna give us a little bit of regeneration. All right, let's uh, go and smack some more fools. These guys have dodged, so we wanna use a normal attack and then use, oh my God, that's a one hit kill. I, uh, no regrets on that, uh, on that weapon at all. And then smack and smack and we are still killing everything on our first turn. This deals seven damage. This gets plus one damage this combat. Uh, eh, pass. Footwears to the right are disabled for each space above this. This is armor. No, we're going full glass cannon. Because it's working for me. Oh, is this a doppelganger? We should be able to kill them. Nice. Plus 25 XP. Excellent. What is this? Broken ring. Conductive adds four block on use. 
Uh, I don't, there's nothing I really want to get rid of. I could get rid of the fish. But, like, I'm kind of, actually, at this point, I'm just kind of being lazy about it. Buy a book. I'm good. <laughs> I got no time to read. I, 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 you know, I could read or I could study the blade. Clearly, I am better off studying the blade. All right. Let's, uh, I don't know if this is, like, the final floor. Maybe. We could very possibly fight this guy, or kill this guy on the first turn, which would be kind of absurd. Well, we didn't kill them, but we did get very close. Um, right, so we can't use our 25 damage weapon again. That being said, we might be able to kill them. No, okay. So, on a rare instance, we, we are... <laughs> We are going to see turn three. That's okay. This guy is going to flee now that his uh, boss is dead. But we're going to kill them anyway, because whatever. Um, yeah, I'm just going to like continue to make our, our backpack look kind of aesthetic. So what is this? All weapons this effect applied. Get this uh, on the use. Adjacent weapons get plus three damage this turn. Really tempting. Conductive, this is a mana weapon. All weapons get this effect. For each adja adjacent gem, this item gets plus three damage. Hmm. On use, wait, all weapons get this effect applied. On use, adjacent weapons get plus three damage this turn. Does that mean whenever I use a weapon, the next weapon gets plus three damage? That seems really good. That seems, like, ridiculously good. And we get some more stuff. Um, whoa, Ethereal Whetstone. Weapons in this column get plus 200% bonus damage this combat. Ooh. Okay. So, we want to put that here, and that way we're still getting the bonus. And we're giving a bonus to our big boy, big lad. And then we can go ahead and also, well, okay, we don't, we, we can move this hatchet here and that way we're, we're buffing four weapons at once. This is, I don't know if maybe I just like stumbled across the perfect run, but this is, this is great. I love this. I love it when I, I do r ridiculously absurd damage. Let's make a deal. Get a rare item of the same type. So we can trade an item away for something a bit better. Well, uh, I mean, we got tons of shivs. Let's get it a shiv. Uh, how's this for a trade? There's no time to say no. Uh, hope you like it. Well, this isn't the wep weapon of the same type at all. <laughs> it's much bigger, and it takes energy and mana, and I wish I had my weapon back. You have absolutely hornswaggled me, sir. You have four-fleshed me. All right, well... Oh well. Can't win them all. Let's just absolutely stomp everything. Oh my god. Um, deals three damage to all enemies. We're good. What is this? Old log. Creates an herb this row. I'm good on that. Boohoo Buckler. I like that just for the name. Creates two gold. Kind of want the piggy bank actually. More gold just out of principle. Would, seems like a really good idea. <laughs> Okay, we're gonna go ahead and just destroy everything. I'm sure there's a way to, like, add gold. What do you mean? Finished reorganizing. I don't know, I don't know what happened there. That was weird. What is this? Um, nope. That one wants space and it gives us armor. Uh, yeah, I was, as I was saying, I don't know if there's maybe a way to optimize our, our weapon here that, like, plus three... Each time we use a weapon, it, it makes the next weapon do plus three damage. I guess the ideal way would be to use weapons in the center first, because then they're going to make other... They're going to buff other weapons sooner. But I don't know if I'm maybe overthinking things a little bit. Uh, that being said, I'm sure I'm sure people would like me to... Um, 
I don't understand what what this is. What this wants me to do. This is gonna give me gold. Finish reorganizing. Why are we adding our gold? I don't. I don't really understand. All right, we just got another hatchet. Deals 10 da damage to all enemies. This item is destroyed on use. Okay, well, we don't really want that. We do kind of want that other hatchet. Tempted to kill. <laughs> all right, you know what? Never mind the gold. We're good on the gold. Is that gold actually gonna get destroyed is my question. And if so, I mean, what what is what is up with gold? Why is it such a, a picky problem child? We're not even, like, getting close to using up... We're gonna get rid of that piggy bank. It's, it's, it's n not okay. Um... Oh, I see. Okay, I get it. So, cleavers on their own don't really do any damage. You want to get a weapon that uses the cleavers, because then they all fall under the same amount of energy. That is actually kind of a neat mechanic. I, I could definitely see building around cleavers. I've 100% uh, built around, I'm, I'm leaving that piggy bank out of spite now. Uh, I could see building, doing a whole build around around daggers. I, you know what, I'm good. You you kind of did me dirty last time, I'll be honest. So we're, we're gonna fight a lizard man, I think. Smack, 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 smack. Or, yeah, we're not even getting through all of our weapons. It's kind of kind of crazy. I love it. You know what? Let's get our four-leaf clover. Four-leaf clover never did me no harm, you know? Four-leaf clover never made me... Ne never asked anything of me. Take a rare item for a curse. Um, take nine damage. All right. Sure. I'll take nine damage. We're, we're covering at a ridiculous rate. This item is a projectile. For each space the destroyed item occupied, this gets... Wait, what? For each space the destroyed item occupied, this uh, gets fi plus 15 damage. Oh, I see. The item to the left is destroyed. <sighs> you know what? Maybe I'm taking nine damage for absolutely nothing, but it's not like I care. Because we're just like on a, a rampage. I should be using uh, weapons near the splint so we at least recover that damage and not be like an absolute moron. <laughs> but you know what? Let me be a moron for once. Alright. You know, it occurs to me what I should do next is get rid of this shield. <laughs> I was thinking about it, and I was thinking, you know what, it doesn't really make sense that I have this shield anymore. It, uh, I haven't actually used it in a very long time. <laughs> so, uh, I should just, uh, I should just replace it with more hatchets. Well, are these, ha yeah, hatchets. Uh, yeah, so, I don't care, yeah, here we go. <laughs> I don't even, I don't, I really don't care right now that, um, the game is, is being, like, very easy. I'm having a lot of fun with this, to be honest. It's really nice to not have to galaxy brain a game in order to to win. Um, that's a good feeling. I, I don't get that feeling often these days. It seems to me like every game I play is, like, if you don't, like, uh, play this game for minimum, like, 300 hours, you're gonna have a bad time. And it's not even you're gonna have a bad time. Wait a minute. On use. Oh, this item is destroyed? I thought it was a, giving me a passive buff. Shoot. So, right as I've removed my only form of defense, uh, I am 100% going to eat a, a small, a, a monicum amount of, of um, damage. It took all of my restraint not to say the actual words. You know, you know what I was going to say. Alright, we, we're, we're still not going to take any damage. I, I, you know what? I'm, I'm not wrong if I didn't take any damage. Goodbye, I don't care if you, if you lived. You win and I level up. All right, we're continuing to build a very aesthetic looking backpack. 
Uh, deal 10 damage to all enemies. Sure, we'll take that. For each empty space to the right. Nah. Dark Lady's Potion. Deals 18 damage. This item is destroyed. I don't really want that. I don't really, I don't really want any of this, to be honest. All I want is more hatchets. Care to do a trade? No, go away. I don't like you. I am 100% going to judge you based on our previous and only interaction. And, uh, you know, that's just gonna have to be how you, how you, you know, deal with it. You're just gonna have to deal with that. You're gonna have to live with that. Wait, cowboy. Um, yeah, we'll take the fish. <laughs> I feel like, uh, I feel like I'm at... Like McDonald's with $15 in my pocket and I'm just looking at the dollar menu. Oh uh, yeah, I'll take the I'll take the hatchet and uh, the shiv. I'll take two shivs actually. And I'm gonna go ahead and take uh Oh wait, what the heck? I'll take a dagger and uh What? I died? What happened? What happened? What happened? <laughs> what happened? What did I do? I, everything was going so well, and then I'm dead? What are you talking about? What do you mean? No. Go back. Stop this. Stop pretending to be dead. Alright, well. Shoot. That's Backpack Hero. You must conquer the dungeon. Yeah, I, I tried. I thought, I, I, I guess uh, I wasn't, I was like super not paying attention. And I, I came across the one enemy that was able to defeat me. Probably they had thorns and every time I was doing damage I was also hurting myself. That's what I imagine is happening. So, you know, that just goes to show you, kids. Uh, even if you're winning and you have no chance of losing, pay attention. You know, make notes. But uh, that's okay. Don't be me. Don't lose the unlosable run. Anyway, this was a Backpack Hero. Thanks again to Jespel uh, for giving me a chance uh, to play it, as well as the Game Development World Championship. Be sure to check uh, check the site out for some other really cool indie games. Link in the description. And if you enjoyed this video, definitely hit that like button and consider subscribing for more content like this. And I'll see you guys next time. Take it easy.